What's up, what's up, what's up? Kiandai? Who goes there? Dios mío, esta música me va a matar. Pues okay. bueno, es Atari 2600, tengo que ser... Tengo que ser... MHP me sigue, ayer me sigue Claudi. Uh, um, well, thank you, thanks Claudi0913 for following me and MWHP. I didn't realize you guys follow me. I assume you guys are English or American, whatever. You're English speakers. Ni siquiera. Ya empezamos bien. Ya Los agentes, ah, porque está bugueado, por razón. Está para serio. Ah, mira, mira cómo voy mejorando, papá. Listo, ya seguimos campeones de la Copa América. A la concha de tu hermana. Entonces, okay, tengo que ir lento. Si voy lento... Ay, no, ya me empezó a romper. Esto te da una vida extra. Le busqué manual. Esto te da una vida extra. No sé qué estoy haciendo jugando a esto. Anda, ¿cómo carajo pasó a través del agujero? Eso es una. Eso es un asco. ¡Ay, Dios! ¡Ay, la puta madre! ¿Cómo carajo me tocó? Ya ni el idiota. El espectador, o el espectador. 
How are you doing, man? Bah, como que hoy. Vení, Helio, la concha de tu madre, te estoy llamando. Bah, anda la puta que te pagué vos también, Helio. ¿Hay algo que.? Ay, tío. Eso es. Eso es un diseño de calidad muy alto. Ay, mierda vos, científico. No hay ninguna manera de. La puta que te parió, no me vas a dar nada, necesito nueve pedazos. Ay, la puta que te. Este juego ya empezó a joderme. Aparece un agente de la puta que te parís ya te roba todo. No, él. él... Me saca los pedazos de Riz y necesitas nueve para que te dé el puto teléfono. Ah, anda, sabes que metete los pedazos en el orto entre la concha de tu hija. No hay nada acá. A ver si llego acá. Y me roba el. Pe... ¡Qué lindo! ¡Qué lindo! Anda la puta que te parió, gente de mierda. Me voy a robar. Aparece de nada, ¡pum! Ya está, me robó todo. Argentina Simulator 2021. Dios santo, esto... I'm not saying much because I really don't have much to comment. I'm just like really like game mode. I, I want to beat this fucking game, and I'm fucking dead again. Oh my fucking god, man! I feel this is my last life. Oh, this is beautiful. I, I, I pressed the fucking button. Press the fucking button, I swear to god I did. There's nothing here. I don't know where the other pieces I guess I'll have to just go around finding Reese's pieces. 
until I, I could give them to Elliot so that he can find a piece of the phone. But I don't know. I mean, it's just. I'm gonna fucking die of this one. Jesus. No, I have one more life. If I if, if I'm if I die here, that's it. It's game over. What the fuck even happened there? I don't know, it's just like, there's no pieces, there's nothing. <sighs> the collision detection of this game is fucking atrocious. Oh my f you motherfucker! Okay, good, okay, good. Let's skip this, please. Skip, skip. 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 Thank you. Why are you even playing this? <laughs> okay, but, I don't know, because I felt like it. <laughs> to be honest, I actually played it uh, a couple of days ago, and I just, you know, I, I wanted to beat the game. Because you, you can actually beat this game. This is one of the few Atari between the 600 games you can actually beat. And, and I couldn't beat it. I, I spent like half an hour. I spent like an hour and a half when I wasn't able to beat it. So now, I'm gonna beat this fucking game. If I could fucking get... What? That is... What the fuck? That is so... Such bullshit. What the fuck? That is such bullshit. You saw that, alright? Motherfucker came out of nowhere, just stole my shit like... It's free real estate, my man. Oh, fuck you. Oh my god, those scientists, they never fucking give up. But anyway, so you can see how riveting this gameplay is. How oh, Christmas 90... <laughs> it was ruined forever. How do I get this guy to stop? Oh. Shrapnel place. Hello, man. How uh, Christmas 92 was ruined forever. Well, this game, man. I, I don't know if Pac Man came out that same month. I know Pac Man was one of the big reasons the Atari 2600 just died. You son of a bitch! I wasn't even close! How did he steal that shit from me? How? You son of a bitch! That is such bullshit! The collision detection of this game is so fucking biased towards you. Now, those fuckers, they can fly over the fucking hole, but, but you can't. You're fucked, man. You're fucked. Technically killed video games in the early 80s. Well, to be fair, one thing you have to keep in mind regarding uh, the... Um, the video game crash is that it was mostly North America. In North America games just die, alright. In Europe, it was more like it changed from why get a console where you can get a computer, because hey, you can get a computer, you can get things for you for the school or everything, but you can also play games. So in Europe, it more like it transferred from console gaming to computer gaming. And in Japan, nothing happened. In Japan, it was it's actually known as the Atari Shock, specifically. Which is a very interesting thing. It's it's, it's always so far correct. It's North America video game crash. Europe, it changed, it transformed. I'm not really sure if E.T. had, had much of an impact on anything. I don't think so. I, I need to check. As I stated before, in Japan, this was a, a nothing burger. No one gave, gave two shits about the Atari, I think. Um, you know, E.T. Honestly, we were actually wanted a <laughs> game about E.T. in the start of Christmas. Why, man? E.T. was a good film. Man, that's, that's ice cold, man. Oh, oh, you, no! What? You saw that shit! That ancient came out of nowhere and just stole my... I, I swear to God, this game actually pisses me off. It's just like you randomly get fucked by, by the... Like, by the RNG, it's like, 
Oh, no. You, you gotta be fucking kidding. No. No, I, I think I'm, I'm gonna start restart the fucking... This is actually disgusting. This is absolutely fucking disgusting. What the fuck is... AT wasn't the only game responsible for that. It was a combination of factors. AT was just... That's correct. That's absolutely correct. Also, another game that can be blamed is Pac-Man. Because it was one of the most anticipated games on the Atari 2600, and it was one of the worst ports I think I've ever seen. It's not like Pac-Man couldn't be done on the Atari. It could. It could effectively be done. It's just, well... Well, Pac-Man was terrible. That and the sheer amount of shovelware that was being released for the Atari 2600, as well as the fact that the market was oversaturated. I have to remember that the Atari wasn't the only console back then. You had the Intellivision, you had the Coleco Vision, you had a lot of things. You just had so much trash going there. Like, so much fucking trash. I've tried to make sure that everything shows up. I apologize if there was something changed. Okay, basically I was just checking my my Discord and everything. Et fan Billy Eilish is green. Um, what the fuck? <laughs> I should go on that. Battlezone on 2600 was unusually advanced for hardware. I, I don't think I played Battlezone. I know the game, but I haven't actually played. Oh my fucking god. Oh, fucking scientist, man. Leave me the fuck alone. Oh, Jesus Christ. You know, this game really does. For fucks. So you touch the fucking like if ET's head even touches the hole, he falls down. And sometimes it's not even that. It's like if he's just close to the hole, he, he just falls down, and, and there's nothing you can do. You have to. Uh, uh, what I just did, you 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 make ET's head like stretch. You know, when you see that like palace, that basically scares the agents, uh, the scientists to go to go fuck themselves. So it's, it's, is that the only means of, of defense against these bitches? Peaches, I said. Peaches, bitches. And I'm fucking dead again. Oh my god. No, I really hate those fucking FBI agents. All they do is steal my fucking shit. Nothing here. Oh, finally, a fucking phone piece. No, no, oh. Boys, I'm seriously cheating, actually. Oh boy, hermano, eso es muy zarpado. Oh, ya me morí otra vez, la puta que te pasa. Why does running take health? Oh, fuck. Me cago en la puta madre.
Leave me the fuck alone! Okay. Okay. Si hago un par de pedazos más, puedo obtener la tercera y última parte. Bueno, me robó una parte. Y me robó una parte. La puta que te parió. Como odio este juego. No hay una puta mierda acá. I hate the fucking cognition detection. You saw that shit, right? You saw... I, I even touched the fucker! How did I... Okay, I... I'm surprised I didn't go into that hole. Game over. Game fucking over. Game over. <sighs> Why is the symbol on the top of the screen? Okay, let me explain a little bit about the game. Uh, the screen went black because I'm checking some things. Relax. It, it's gonna come back. Um, Uh, as I was saying, um, excuse me, give me a second, because I was just checking some things. Uh, okay, let me explain a little bit. In ET, the, there is this, like, icon, you know, that all you see at, at the top of the screen. Well, that's an action you can do. When you press a button, ET will do that action. For example, if it's an arrow, ET will teleport to another location. If it's, um, if it's... Like an icon of like a head, like yelling, you can call Elliot and you can give him your, your Reese's pieces, which gives you points, unless you have nine, in which case Elliot gives you a piece of the phone. Uh, if it's, um, ba basically, it's just an indicator of where you can do a certain action. That's, that's how it works. Which is, <laughs> and each screen has a like, certain action, for example, that, that, that thing, like this, this is the landing pad. After you phone home, you have to. Oh my fucking god, I'm already filling the hole. You have to stay in, stand in that place. Okay. What? This tells you where the pieces of the phone are. You have to collect three so that you can phone home. Oh, so Pingus, well, why did you like the ET film? It's like, if I keep wanting to, uh, uh, oh, for fuck's sake. If you wanted a game of ET, it's, it's fine. It's like, what was the point of film? Uh, I mean, the point of your, um, like, it's a good game, you know. You know, the, the one thing I'm going to say is uh, that I really don't understand why they made a game of ET like this. Why not just make a game, like, if you're going to make an, e a, an ET game, why not do it based off, you know, the the last scene of the film, you know, when, when Elliot and, and the company, they all escape. That's the best, that's one of the best parts of the film, and that's actually the part that comes closest to being a game. Like, like a bike game, we, we ride, or, you know, that would make a lot of sense. That would actually make a, a great sense for, a, for an E.T. game, and it could have been a, a fun little arcade game. Like, it, it's not like it was uncommon for Atari games to make a you know, to adapt one specific action scene of a film and make that the game. Like, I don't know if you ever played Empire Strikes Back. The, the one scene they adapted from the film, it's the one where, look, you know, it's on the, on the fucking ships, you know, those ships, you know, that they have, like, the wires, he has to tie, has to, he uses the wire to trip down, you know, the, um, what the fuck was the thing? The walkers. Remember that scene in the film? When the huge walkers go and storm the base, the rebel base? It's that scene in the film. And you know what? It's a great, uh, it's a great scene to that game. And for what I remember, it, it's a pretty fun game. It's a pretty fun game. E.T., do you like to torture yourself? Like, yeah, I think so. Uh, after this, I'm, if, if I beat this fucking game today, I hope I beat the game today, I'm gonna play... Jay 
D. What the fuck? What's this? Are those the initials of a developer or something? Is this an easter egg? What the fuck is that? Yo, what, what, what the fuck is that? Real talk, I have no clue what I just did. Oh! Oh! No! Hijo de puta! La concha de tu vieja! Otra vez me robó! Otra vez me robó! He stole from me again! He stole my shit again! You son of a bitch! That fucking ancient! How, how does he know? How does he- Oh my- No! I wanted to fucking- You fucking piece of shit game! I just- No! Stop stealing my fucking shit! You're not even close! How are you stealing my shit from me? What, you fucking psychic or something? Leave me the fuck alone! The fucking scientist never gives up! I was doing so well! So well that the age he just got- Has- His bed is a bunch- Okay, finally, piece of the phone. Pretty sure this game was just unfinished. He probably went, wanted to make something like adventure, but more advanced, but around short in time. Yeah, that, that's probably it. It's probably it's probably like adventure. Like that's that probably was intent. Adventure was kind of fun. I mean, it, it's very basic. I played adventure to PS2. Um, in that like little collection, it, it's a bit basic for me, but it, it's pretty fun, from what I remember. Um, I, I guess they wanted to do something like that, but it's a bit arcadey. Compared with Adventure, Adventure wasn't as arcade as other games. It's very, it's very cool to the play a Troy, Troy Six and Voltaire. <laughs> now, if if I finish playing this fucking game and the a, this FBI agent doesn't fucking steal my shit, oh, finally some good fucking luck. If if I beat this fucking game, I'm gonna play Pac-Man. It was hell in the poor make it was on a game document he was given. Yeah, I believe he was given like two weeks. I think I think it was Howard Scott Warshaw who made this game. I think he also did Yards Revenge, which is one of the best games on the Atari twenty six hundred. Uh, I played that game. I guess you could say I'm a bit of a connoisseur for the Atari to What in the name of fuck was that hitbox? That you, that that needs to be clipped. What the fuck was that? That is some MK11 hitbox shit. That is... Oh, uh, yeah, I have all the pieces. Oh shit! The FBI agent! Get the fuck back! Get the fuck back! Go, go back to hell, you motherfucker! Back to, to hell with you! Oh shit! It's the last piece! It's the last piece! Okay, I can phone home! I can phone home! I'm gonna fucking phone home. I'm gonna beat this fucking game. I'm gonna see this fucking shit, man. Where, where do I phone home? I need to find like the place where I have to phone home. No, no, that fucking. Okay. Uh, oh. Holy shit, this fucking guy. Get the fuck back. Get the fuck back. I have, I have the that symbol. I have that symbol. You, you can't touch me if I, if I stretch. Oh shit, shit, shit. That's fucking scary, man. That is. The Exorcist has nothing on this. Okay, where did I fucking phone home? Oh shit! Get the fuck back! Get the fuck back! I have that. That simple. Come on, Sasha. Todo bien? Perdóname que estoy hablando todo inglés. Where the fuck do I phone home? I have to find the spot. I wasn't it. You. That is such bullshit. That is such bullshit. Good thing that the AH and the FBI like glitch totally. I, I really have no clue where it's supposed to call phone home. Where the fuck do I phone home? It's, it's not here. Oh, it's scientist. Look, you. S oh my god, that's so bullshit. Look, look, he's just walking through the fucking. Get the fuck back. Get the fuck back. Look, look. Haha! Ha, I have the power, motherfucker! I have the power! I have the power. Where the fuck do I phone home? I have no clue. There is no visual indication. You just have to, like, go around all over the fucking map. And hopefully. I I'm gonna die at this rate. I'm trying to find the fucking. Where. Christ, where, where the fuck? Look, look, I, 
How in the name of fuck did he get me? This game, man. This is the phone. Phone, 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 phone. No, phone. Fuck you. Phone. Fuck you. Where's, where's the fucking phone? Home. Phone home. Phone home. Phone home. From home. Phone from. I play with. I'm just trying to. And I'm dead. But I, I don't know where to phone home. Where do I phone home? I have the fucking phone. Where do I phone home? That's the landing pad. This kid for you both ever <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna try. Oh, I, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna lose all my lives at this rate. I, I, I have no clue where the phone home. Like, did it glitch out? Is there no phone home? I, I have. I'm also being. Very careful because it could be an AI. Oh my fucking god. Me fui a hacer un café. Bueno, todavía no sé. Estoy acá. Tengo el teléfono y no, y no puedo encontrar dónde tengo que llamar. Ok, so here's. I. There's. Where do I. Oh my fuck. I can't figure out where. Yeah, may maybe, but I don't know, man. I'm just trying to find where to fucking. I think the game glitch out. Uh, there is no phone home. I think the game glitch out. Real time, real shit. I think the game glitched out. Oh man, I I'm actually about to fucking die. Shamasu Saki, it is. Yeah, no puedo controlar donde llama ese sistema. Tengo el teléfono y estoy caminando como loco por todas partes. Where the fuck is there's an icon? It has to, it has to like it must have glitched. There is no explanation. Why can I find? And he stole my fucking phone pieces. I, I was fearing that I can't fucking find this shit because this fucking piece of shit game doesn't fucking. Where the fuck do I come from? Home, fucking. He stole another piece and I'm fucking dead. Game over? Is it game over? Yep, game over. Game fucking over. The game glitch. That was a fucking glitch. There is no, no place where you can phone home. You saw that. There's supposed to be like this little icon on you of like an alien and that's when you can phone home. There's no fucking phone home. He didn't show up. That is so, such bullshit. I had the pieces. What the fuck? This game, man. This game's fucking hard for all the wrong reasons. I can't beat this fucking game because it's just like I, I get the phone pieces and it, I I think one at uh, one time I think like like when I play hey hi Elliot I, I got the pieces and it, and it just like it didn't work when I it called. So I guess it's impressive to be special. Yeah, I guess. This game is very Freudian. Your both adversaries are male, but when you extend your neck, which symbolizes your penile superiority, they cower in fear. Great Wars by Aller. I love how, like, the scientist doesn't have to play by the game's rules. He just flies all over the fucking, like, uh, flies over the fucking holes, and here I am just uh, uh, trying to avoid getting sucked in. I'm just trying to figure out where I, the fuck am I supposed to... Guys, how in the name of fuck... Okay, I got he glitched. I, I, wanna, is, I don't think it's an emulation problem. The Stell emulator is a, a very good, very accurate emulator. Oh, good, I found another piece. I need two more Reese's Pieces a day, I can trade them to... You motherfucker! I, then I could trade them to Elliot. 
I did realize one thing. Recess pieces are limited in a game. They they don't show up always. And you go fuck yourself. I wasn't you mother for that is such bullshit. Oh what the f what the the design of this game fucking is atrocious, man. Two weeks is, is being generous. What the f feels like we're done in one fucking day. But how can I? I want to scare off the agent, uh, the scientist. Where? Okay, I found no. What the fuck even happened there? Okay, so I think if you're where I can find home in this session. I remember the canapos favor. Can I post? Yeah, can I post for some for some top quality shit? I I think I posted that shit. Um. Oh, Jesus Christ! Get the fuck out! Okay, so I call for Elliot. Elliot has to come. And this scientist just said, "Fuck you." Elliot, come. Elliot, come. Are you gonna fucking come here? You're gonna just sit there. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I saw that one. Okay, so Elliot just glitched. I, I gave him the Reese's pieces. He's supposed to give me. And I just get kidnapped by a science. Okay, give me the fucking phone, Elliot, because I'm. I wanna smash your fucking head in. You don't just give me the fucking phone. He steals my shit. He just steals my shit. Yeah. He can't give me pieces unless there's unless there's no one on screen. You motherfucker. What the f This game is actually aggravating. You should play this game. You have no idea how aggravating it is. Most car games, you generally tend to die because of your own fault. Here it's like, you know, the, the game just decided, you know, let, let's fuck you over because... Man, she keep boys by the first eight. Oh yeah, I remember that shit. Okay, I got the food form. Get the fuck out of my face. Get the fuck out of my face. Okay, I think I know where it was. I think it was a... No, fuck you. Look at that fucking shit. Look at that ancient... The agent is such bullshit. Where was it? Where was it? Fuck. Get the fuck! Get the fuck away! Get the fuck away! Get the fuck away! Fuck away! Fuck away! Where was it? I have the phone! Because there's a person person on the screen, right? There has to be no one no one has to be on the screen for the phone to work. Is that right? Is that why the phone's not working? Because I have all three fucking pieces and this fucking shit doesn't work. I have no clue why it's not working. Because I'm standing in the fucking place. Get the fuck away from me. You get the fuck away from me. Where's the fucking fucking shit? Look at that! Holy shit! Fucker's a ninja! There's a fucking ninja, man. The, the dots, they do, they do shit. I, I, I'll tell you later. Wait, wait. I have to, I have to get to the fucking. I'm fucking. It. Okay, okay. But if, if I get, if I get the phone, phone, phone. Okay, finally, finally. Uh, I got it. Oh, oh where, where's the phone? Where's the landing pad? Where's the landing pad? Landing pad. Okay, it's here. Okay. Get the fuck away. Okay, we're beating this fucking game, guys. We're beating it. No, get the fuck away. Get the fuck away. Okay, 
I'm here! No! What? No! That's such bullshit! No! I wasn't... Oh! Okay, okay. Get the fuck... No! Get the fuck away from me! Get the fuck away from me. I have the phone. I have the phone. I can't fucking tell this guy... No! He stole my... I was so close, I'm a fucking moron, I'm a fucking moron, I was so close, why did I, why did I stay there, I should have just stayed down with the fucking thing, oh my god, I should have stayed on the landing pad, oh, this hurts, this sucks, this fucking sucks, no, <laughs> What what did the dots do? Well, the dots they are Reese's pieces. Remember that that scene in the film where E.T. eats like Reese's pieces and shit. If you give Reese's pieces to Elliot, if you give nine, you have to give specifically nine. Then he gives you a piece of the phone. If you give him less, he just gives you points. But you can also eat the Reese's pieces at a specific point and gain back health. Okay, so I need to find one more piece of the phone. Oh, look at that son of a bitch. He's already waiting. He's that fucking disgusting FBI agent. And he stole my shit! Again! Oh my god, I'm about to fucking smash everything for fucking bloody poke. Oh, this fucking game. Okay, I got... Okay, one of the pieces is here. I'm about to die. I'm about to die anyway. I'll have to start again. You know. I I think that's it. I don't have any more lives. This generally disgusting. Generally, all Mr. G star. I I know him, but no, I just say disgusting because it's I, I like the, f the word, not because of him. I I don't know where I got the word. I mean, I I, I learned how to swear because of the ABGN and somewhat the Aria Gamer. I don't think it was because of G Star. Oh my fucking god! I need one more fucking piece, please. Let me, let me do this. Get the fuck away from me, you fucking creepy scientist! I'm I'm about to die, right? Am I dead? Yeah, game over. It's game over, right? Oh, I was so close. I was so close. That is such bullshit. It's it's my fault. That's that's one my fault. That, that right there is my fault. Okay, okay, now we're doing it. Now, now I know. I know this game is bullshit. Okay, first let's let's. Where, where the fuck is the landing pad? It's in this screen. It's always in this screen. Okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, this three. Okay, is there a way to scare off the agents? Okay, here. Here's the landing pad. Here's the, the scare off. Okay. Question mark. Question mark. Nothing. Fuck. Okay, you know what? It's, it's still sh Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's still that shit for me. I, I wanna deal with the fucking shit. Okay, so here's where I have to call... It's, it's in the arrow. If, in case I forget, it's the fucking arrow. Right arrow. That's where I have to phone home. I don't want to go down because there's a fucking agent there, so it's like, let me go. Let me fucking go. This... Oh, God. Why did he put this fucking, like, teleportation ability? It's so fucking annoying. You just fall. That's what usually happens. You just fall. Half the time you go to that screen, you just fall into a random hole. Fuck this piece of shit game. God, this fucking agent again, man. Uh 
okay, so there was another piece of the same fucking screen. The game only shows you if there's one piece on the screen when you use the question mark. It doesn't show you if there's many, of, if there's several. You have to use the question mark again. Why doesn't it show you both? I have no clue. That's such bullshit. So you'll get shown one at a time. That is... O sea, vos viste eso, Ashe, solo te muestra un pedazo de la puta que lo parió a la vez. Cuando se hace el signo de pregunta para saber dónde están el, los pedacitos, no te dice... Si hay más de uno en la en pantalla, no te dice. Ok. Oh my fucking god, that fucking hole. Ok. Ok, I got the full... Ok, I have to go to the arrow now and I have to phone home. I have to phone home. Oh my god. And he stole my shit! Look at that. Oh, look at that. He, he, he literally, I, I, I could avoid, I could avoid get, getting... Yes, punk, but what? Such bullshit. It's... I, I'm falling in the same fucking hole. I don't have control. Sometimes, then it just forces you down the hole. Like, here, I... Just let me the... Go. Jesus. Get the fuck away. Extra life. <sighs> so this game actually is genuinely fucking clear. Oh, well, finally. I pressed the fucking. Stop flying, ET. I'm gonna beat the fucking shit out of you, you fucking piece of shit alien. And look, look at our friend. Our Get the fuck away. Oh my god. Okay, I need to. Where's the arrow? I need to find the right arrow. I need to find the right arrow. Right arrow. I didn't touch the fucking. Well, I did, but fuck you, anyways. Okay, so I, I'm starting to run low on. Okay. Uh, okay, now I have to find the right hole. Phone home to get the fuck out of this place pronto. Oh, oh, get. I hate this fucking agent. It's not an agent, it's, it's a scientist. Okay, okay, phone hole, phone hole. No! I... Okay. Landing pad, where's the fucking landing pad? Where's the landing pad? Guys, where's the fucking landing pad? Where's the landing pad? Okay, I'm landing the landing pad. Beat the game, please. Yes! I did it! <laughs> Finally! <laughs> oh, it's so good. I beat the fucking game. First time I ever beat AT. Oh, man. <laughs> thanks, thanks, bro. <laughs> what a horrible fucking game, man. Congratulations. <laughs> Congratulations. You have completed a great game and proved the justice of our culture. Now go arrest, now go arrest our hero. <laughs> yeah, that's the ending. <laughs> Well, it's the Atari 2600, you know. But yeah, I beat the fucking game. Uh, oh my god. I beat this fucking Oh, <laughs> what a game this was, man. What a game. I, I would give it a 7, 7.5 out of 10. <laughs> you should compare player with the Atari. Yeah, man, I'm, I'm a... This is high-level ET play, man. You're seeing here. You're seeing guys right here. High level ET play. Still more satisfying. <laughs> ET's been running. Still more satisfying than ACF. Ooh. Talk about talk about ice gold, man. <laughs> Badass. <laughs> ACM. Now that's a game I could stream. Now that's that would be a great game to stream. <laughs> But but I want to play the vanilla version, like launch day version. I want I I want to play that version when I mean, it was really fucking buggy, like 
to shit. Like, I remember some of the bugs you could do in vanilla. Like, um, uh, you could push the alien queen through a wall. Like, that kind of glitchiness. I have no idea how much they, they patch the game out. I know the overhaul does a lot for the game. Like, it fixes the AI. Like not just the type, but also improves the AI. It's not just that. Uh, which is impressive because he also, uh, the AI is, uh, from what I heard, really fucking good now. Like, the, like, the general comment from what I heard in Overhaul is actually pretty good. Uh, like, to my understanding, with the Overhaul, it's actually kind of a decent game. Like, the story's still shit. I I'm not sure if there's as much marine combat. I don't think there is. Like, the story's still shit and normal design isn't great. But the combat is actually decent now. Like, the game doesn't look as terrible as it once did. So it's a decent game now, but still, imagine dropping money for that. Like, even with the overhaul, well, I, I don't have much place to really complain about that because of, of a certain project I'm doing that's coming to an end very soon. I really don't have much of a place to really complain about that. And besides, the guy who did the patch, uh, Templar GFX, he did, he did a fantastic job. I was actually kind of interested in playing the game with that patch just to see what it was, like what it would be. But I don't know. Well, so we finish E.T. Well, I'm a man of my word, usually, I think. <laughs> so now we're going to be playing Pac-Man, the second worst game of the Atari 2600. So if you play, one thing I wanted to check is that if you press fire, you start, you, yeah, the game just loops. You have to press fire, but the game just loops. Okay, so I'm not doing another fucking of that. I, I'm, I'm not as masochistic as I may seem. I don't hate myself for that, okay. Oh, no. Oh no. I, I remember seeing this game. I remember the ghost being pretty much impossible to see. Oh no, this is bad. This is really bad. Your world, Akuma City. No, 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 the kid kind of looks like <laughs> That makes me a good point, lady. Uh, it, it's meant to be Elliot from the film. Hey, I played this last week, but what, the Atari version? Oh, Pac-Man came out in 1981. I thought it came out in 80, but it says, but it says 82. On, um, okay. The ghosts were actually easier to see a TV screen as the game originally ran on. Yeah, I, I mean, I guess. I don't know. I remember that even back then, that the complaints about the ghosts were always there. So you can really see the ghosts even back then. Because you have to keep in mind one thing regarding the ghosts in, in this version of the game. They're translucent. Um, like, the flickering. It's different from the arcade version. I don't think Mrs. Pac-Man did this. It came out of the Atari. Just for playing yeah, that's a good pick, but I, I'm pretty sure even on the on the old TVs, they still look pretty bad. But I know this was a major complaint with the game. That was one of the major reasons they refunded the game. This and ET were games they just refunded. New Game Plus, MLG, ET Speedrunner. <laughs> oh, God. No, thank I'll pass. I'll pass. Okay, so let's... Okay, that was a terrible play for me. That, that, that is the first time I... I, I can see them somewhat, though. That's not a problem. I'm pressing up, it's not really registering. Uh, well, it's more fun than AT, at least.
Okay. Yeah, that's true. At least this doesn't fucking crash all the fucking time. Go fucking... Oh, shit. The controls are really awkward, though. I'm holding... It's like you have to hold things... Um, before you can really do things. I don't know, I, I play worse. But uh, you can. I, I don't know if this. If I have M Mrs. Pac Man, I could probably play that just to compare. Ever played the MSX version? No, I haven't. I played. Uh, the first version of Pac Man I played was on the PS1. It came with Pac Man World. I wasn't that particularly good player that I've always been kind of terrible at Pac Man. Uh, Pac -Man. Oops, nearly got killed there. The controls are really awkward. It's like it, it, it's it's like Pac-Man doesn't really try to let you hold that. I mean, I guess it's I mean it's faithful to the game, but it, it feels janky. Compared to the RK version. Every time you die, you hear this sound clip. Oh shit! And it goes in a different. Oh, that's interesting. I don't know if it, I don't know if it goes have different like the RK version. I don't think so. That's something they, they don't seem to have. They just seem to move in random pi patterns. Pac-Man has all sorts of spin-offs over the years, but where is the fighting game spin-off? Pack food just begs to be made. Oh my god, I'd rather fucking die, man. I think I might do it with the sprite limit or something. Just so, what? I see it as a spin off. What, you mean Pac Man 2 The New Adventures? Which is the true and official sequel of the game? Okay, I wasn't paying attention. Once you understand different AI for the. Yeah, yeah, that's something I didn't do. My dad used to love playing Pac-Man when I was a kid. He was way better than me. My dad also loved playing Tetris. He was really fucking good at that. I always struggled with Tetris. I suck. I still suck major ass at Tetris. Uh, I, I, I was pretty decent at, at Championship Edition TX. I don't think it was that terrible at that. I don't know, I have to admit, may maybe it's because E.T. was just so fucking miserable, but this isn't as bad. At least this is based off an actual good game, so you know, it's like, it it's just not as good as the, you know, as the, as the arcade, but, well, it was, it's always, well, it was gonna be a port to Imperial Harbor, and something was gonna be cut eventually, essentially, but it's not the worst port I've seen. I love Pac-Man, it's probably my favorite Pac-Man. Oh, I played Pac-Mania uh, when I was a kid on PlayStation 1. I think I played it a couple of times after that. Uh, yeah, jumping definitely makes it a lot more fun, and I don't know what the fuck I was uh, accomplishing there. Th does this count as beating the game? No, I don't think so. It's just loops like the original Pac-Man did. You just don't have any cutscenes in the middle of like a giant Pac-Man eating the fucking ghost. I don't know if I shame the, the, you can turn into a giant Pac-Man in the game. That would have been so fucking awesome. Like if late game you you could turn into giant fucking Pac-Man, that would have been fucking amazing. Hitboxes for the ghosts are much less forgiving than the arcade version. In the arcade version, you can kind of edge the ghosts a bit. Here, it's like if you just even come remotely close in contact with ghosts, you're kind of fucked. Okay, 
Okay, I was playing shit. <laughs> they say that when the end times come, a giant Pac-Man would devour the universe. I played Pac-Man 2 on the SNES, by the way. I, I, I have no clue what to do, man. I just kind of stumble around, do shit. I don't even know what the fuck you're supposed to do. Maybe I should read the manual or something. Go, go down! Jesus Christ, Pac-Man. Go the fuck down. Pac-Man to this time's person. Pac-Man forever. How about that? Only took 14 years to make, man. You've revolutionized video games everywhere. Look at Pac-Man. He's more alive than ever. Just like that other series. I'm happy that Gearbox saved Duke Nukem. You can see that. Pac- Pac- Forever <laughs> for the greatest scene to call me. I'm reading the chat at the same time playing- I'm doing like dog shit. I'm just being the first level barely. I'm really not playing very well. I'm gonna say definitely feel like kinda jacking you know, on responsive. Could stream some DNF. Yeah, the, the ghost hitbox box definitely seems like. Okay, yeah. Tell me, tell me the punchline. I don't know, I've seen worse, but it's not a particularly good version. I, I know Mrs. Pac-Man, Junior Pac-Man, I don't know, it's it, it much better than this. The post says I would not press him I haven't spoken for over two years. Oh, damn. Rest in pieces. Uh, no, nah, you know what, I'm, I'm gonna change games. Uh, let's change it up. Let, let's play other shit. What can we play? Star Fox. Is this something to do with... What the fuck is this? More like resting reasons? <laughs> Battle... <laughs> Battle song, maybe, but let me do Star Fox first. What the fuck is this? Huh? Okay, you can shoot. Uh... What the fuck? What's going on? I'm a ship, I guess I'm the Star Fox. Man... This kind of blows. I have no clue what the fuck I'm doing. I, this is because I need to read the manual. Do a barrel. <laughs> it's basically a funny. Oh, you played this game? Uh, I, I, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Defender was was easier to do. Oh, you have played this game. So, uh, what is this? Shitty Defender? Go for Joust. Oh, fuck. Oh, take that, yes, son of a bitch. I'm too fucking good for this shit. It's a mediocre game in for a time. Yeah, I can tell. It, it, it really feels like a shitty defender now that I realize. Like, the way you move, it's reminiscent of a defender, but. Like, very janky mediocre. So, uh, like, why would you play this when you could just play a Fender, you know? The Fender was more fun. Just go for Chows. No, let's play E.T. again! <laughs> no. Uh, can you actually play some of, like, the really... Like, 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 shit like Custer's Revenge? Is that allowed on Twitch? Or not? I get the feeling it would be bad if I did that kind of shit. ET2, this time it's person. Okay, uh, 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 okay, enough. That was enough. 
Um, where the fuck is? I want to see if there is Mrs. Pac-Man. Okay, this is Mrs. Pac-Man. Okay, you hear the music? The ghosts are much easier to see. Okay, controls are way better. They're not as unresponsive. Ghosts are easier to see as well. The visuals just look way better. Like... Okay, so... Okay, so... so... Oh, sorry. Sorry, because it wasn't captured the screen. Okay, here is here's here's Miss Pac-Man. Okay, look at this. Look at this. Look, the ghosts are easy to see. And the controls are much more responsive. The visuals are way better. Eternal commercial for blood based on ET. ET the extra charisma. Oh my god, just stop, Allard. You're gonna fucking kill me with that. I'm not sure if they have the different AIs for the ghosts implemented. I think they do. They're showing up. Okay, but look at this. This is Miss Pac-Man. You see this, right? Yeah. Yeah, it, it, okay, that was a good port. Okay, so there was no excuse for Pac-Man to be like that. Especially that fucking sound. Good lord. Here's... Okay, give me a second, I need to... Uh, here's Junior Pac-Man. This came out 1984. Okay, this is even better. This is, oh shit, they're scrolling and shit. I don't think that was. Okay, I'm playing like fucking dog shit. Okay, this is actually fucking good. Like, holy shit. just found out there is a 3 remake of Defender and GameCube. Oh, really? I thought the the, the only re remake Defender got was... Well, wasn't there a Jaguar remake of Defender? Okay, this is actually kind of fun. Like, this is actually a, a, a genuinely good port. This is even better than Miss Pac-Man. It's fast, it's fluid. The controls are even better than Miss pac Okay. And I'm playing a complete dog shit, but that's, that's beside the point. That's besides the point. I mean... The visuals are really good for a party. Yeah, okay, I'm playing like shit. Holy shit. So, yeah, there, there is no excuse for Pac-Man being like that. Okay, let's play Joust. Be let's do Beaver's Request. Beaver's this game I played, uh, you know, also with this kid. Okay, I, I, that was, I wasn't trying to do that. That was com com a complete fool. Yeah, that, that, that was terrible. You've never seen Joust? Okay, controls are kind of awkward in this first. Or maybe I just I haven't really played Joust in such such a long time. It's actually kind of hard for me. Okay, okay, take the fuck. I I freaking played the NES version. I think it was an NES version of this game. Oh my fucking god! I'm playing like shit. Hey, now we're talking. No, fuck. I knew it. Oh, hey, that was good. Okay, so, 
so I have to catch the fuck eggs before they hatch. Okay, let's try again. Ah! I'm gonna. Is anyone here a soccer fan? Well, I'm not a soccer fan, a soccer fan but I'm gonna. I'm gonna be watching the America Cup finale. Argentina versus Brazil. Will Messi finally win? Will Argentina finally win a fucking cup? We haven't won anything since There we go. Fuck. Imagine a Joust film. <laughs> yeah. Well, you, you're jousting, really. Like you, it's it's a guy with a stick or or something like 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 a weapon of some sort. You basically have to like hit them like like stomping them and that 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 turns the chicken into an egg they have to get like the um the egg and you win by killing everyone that's it really ostriches okay yeah i was suspecting one giant mutant chicken <laughs> I I'm not really sure what I was expecting there. Okay, now that one's a good one. No! I nearly got killed. Oh, that's such bullshit. Fucking fly! Okay, there we go. One more, one more, baby. Fuck. Okay, I go for the hitbox. Oh shit! Yeah, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh shit! See if I can get to run five.
let's try another game. James Bond, 007. I think this game wasn't released. But this is technically the first. Uh, okay. I guess I'm playing as James Bond. Fucking f f Uh, I'm trying to remember. 1984. Which film came out back then? That was Living Daylight. Yeah, that was. Uh, this was before License to Kill. So this is. I'm guessing this is based off Living Daylights? No, Living Daylights was way later. What am I fucking saying? This is Roger Moore. Uh, What's the final Roger Moore film? It, it, it's it's a beautiful kill, but wh what year did that film come out? It came out in 1985. And Octopus came out in 83. No, this is Octopus, right? Yeah, I, I, I know. I, my my aiming sucks, that's why. What am I even shooting at? What's that? A film? Okay, that's a helicopter. <sighs> What's that thing on the sky? Is that supposed to be some sort of diamond? Is this diamonds are forever? I, I can't shoot the helicopter now. Uh, now it's... Uh, uh, I, I, if anyone could tell me what the fuck I'm doing, please, please let me know, thanks. I have no clue what Bond film this is based off. Because I, I don't remember this. I really don't remember. Wait, well, yeah, fuck this game. It's based on Diamond Star Forever, level 1, The Spy Who Loved Me, level 2, Moonraker, level 3, and For Your Eyes Only, level 4. Okay. So, it's, so it's mostly based off the fucking uh, Moore era, which is, I, I still think that's the worst. Ball on air, right? not because the films were campy, but because the films just weren't particularly very good. You can do campy, I think. Like, looks at your place just about it's like 007 selection every time, and looks at place just about the same. Damn, that's cool. You know, there were a bunch of 007 Legends prototypes that just came out if, if you were interested. I think for the Xbox 360. So, I, I don't know what, what I'm gonna play now. Elevator action, a prototype. Oh, that's interesting. Now, let's leave that. <laughs> Other occasion. Mm. You're welcome. Um, Return of the Jedi. It's Death Star Battle, Ewok Adventure. There's no no game where you fly Vader. That's, that's kind of terrible. Walker Schussel der Polizisten or Shrek? What? Uh, that, that's my German. Well, and X Men. Not X Men, X Men. I'm a curious. What the fuck is this? Oh shit. Never mind. Uh, you guys didn't see anything, right? You didn't see a a any of that? It's still a back screen. It's a fucking boring game. <laughs> It's a fucking porn game! <laughs> yeah, oh man, thank god. It's a fucking porn game! <laughs> you, didn't, you guys didn't see, but there was a, a woman, uh, like, big tits, c coming out of like, I, like some sort of drawer. <laughs> oh my fuck. X Men. Oh, oh no, oh no. <laughs> I even have like manufactured Miguel Castillo HQ Pawn. Poon. Oh my god. <laughs> Sorry, gotta take off. Uh, how about, okay, see you, man. Thanks for dropping by. <laughs> oh man. Excellent. <laughs> bye bye. Oh man, this is some quality shit. Okay, so let's. Let's play an art game. What can I play? Room of Doom. Room of Doom. What's this? It was, uh, uh, no, I'm, I'm not. I'm not showing anything because I'm already afraid I'm gonna stumble into a fucking porn game. 
Yeah, it's a black screen. I know. Uh, I I didn't show the game. It's a, because I I think it was a stick, but I immediately just saw a dig and it's like, no, I don't want. I want to <laughs> play another boring game by accident. Is, is customer's revenge in this in this room that I have? Oh yes, it is. Oh God, no, 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 no. Okay. Um. Okay, let, let me find an actual game we can play. Oh, Battle Zone. Oh, Pigness just left. Oh, fuck it. I, I'm gonna play it. Um. Oh shit, this is actually really impressive. Oh, oh, holy shit, this is actually seriously fucking impressive. Okay, this is actually genuinely fucking impressive for. Okay, no, R real shit. This is genuinely fucking stunning. This is an Atari 2600. Yeah, I... But you guys aren't seeing it. Guys, are you seeing the game or no? I, I should play with it or no? Yeah, Pingus wasn't lying. This is actually real impressive. This is actually really accurate to the arcade game. You have definitely have like some sort of parallax effect. Honestly, if some of the graphics could be a little more detailed, this could actually pass as something you could see on the NES. Holy shit, this is my this is impressive. And it's actually really fun to play as well. Look at this fucking effect. This is what fucking black magic they do with this shit. This is actually really fucking cool. Okay, I'm playing like dog shit. I'm playing really bad now. I, I I can play DNF better than this game. That's actually fucking embarrassing to admit. You have a radar that tracks where where you We have different enemy types. Oh shit, this game's hard, man. This game doesn't fuck around. Those fucking flyers. Blood to stream went. Oh my god. Why? You're getting your revenge for all the shit posting I do, right? That's why you ask. <laughs> like, what? Just I, I went to actually finish the game on my own. No streams or anything. I, I actually thought at one point of doing like a blood two stream. I have the game. I don't know what the fuck should shock me. It, it, is it a long game? No, it's like five hours long. But it, it's a very hard game, though. It's it's a very very hard game. Not for the right reasons. So to be fair, Blood One was kind of bullshit as well. Even if you knew, like the dirt, you know, like cultists, cult, even crash that, crash down, cultists suffer. Like the like, directors went to shit. And then you had like good, good idea of, of like where all the secrets were. Blood One was still kind of bullshit. If you weren't careful, it's a key reason why I just prefer the three. Yeah, that's true. Blood One actually had good shit. Like, like the bullshit, bullshit to good meter in Blood 1 was skewed towards it being good, whereas Blood 2 is skewed towards being bullshit. And it often tends to be way more bullshit than Blood 1. Like, you, crouching doesn't do anything with regards to the accuracy. Like, enemies at least make their presence really known, they, they yell all the fucking time. So you can, so you can often use, like, like the noob to, like, kill them, but oftentimes, Blood 2 is a game that... But after that, you just die. Bluetooth is a game that, from what I've heard from people who like the game, it's much better to play on easy because at least there the, the bullshit doesn't fuck you over as badly, so you, you can actually kind of enjoy the game. Like, it's still bugging the shit, but at least it doesn't you know, murder you in five seconds. I don't know, is the, are the Blood 2 levels actually good? Like, I, I know the game is a bit more linear and it played that game, but like, the levels didn't seem bad. Like, the issue really comes more in the, like, like the combat of the game, the AI of the game, that was kind of the problem with the game, not, you know, like, from what I've seen the levels, the levels seem like, well, there, there were some repetitive levels, I do remember that, like, you need less levels, but, but that, but that's easy enough to fix, just cut those levels up, okay, the hitbox of the tank is huge, if, if, if you're not shooting before they do, you, you're dead. Oh, my, my, my back 
piece of shit. Yeah, playing actually kinda good now, eh? of arcade games are fun to go back to. I, I can't go back to the Odyssey because that's just, you know, like, it, it's not even a system, it's just, okay. Like, you, you produce a signal on your screen and then it's like you have overlays. The Odyssey is just not good, even for the time it was kind of terrible, to be honest. The 2600 I can go back to. This is like the first I can go back to. But I, I won't go back to every second gen gaming system. Some of the games are just kind of very flat and boring. Not to mention that the ColecoVision the ColecoVision, the Intellivision, I, I'm not as big of a fan as, for those systems as I am with the Atari. The Atari is actually kind of fun. Okay, I'm gonna do one more game and then I'm gonna call it quits for this stream. Uh, a Blood 2 uh, stream could happen, to be honest. But I don't rule out that possibility. It would be fucking terrifying. I'm, I'll admit it's fucking terrifying. see what could I play next to cap off the stream uh, I'm gonna play some pitfall play some pitfall pitfall is a pretty fun game Oh man, that sounds classic. Fuck. Oh, fuck's sake. Okay, I'm gonna have to do Oh! Oh man, no, no, I'm fucking terrible. Okay. What the fuck? Let me try again. Let me try again. How, how did you beat the key? You had to go through all the screens, right? Okay, I'm gonna try it one more time. If not, then call me quits. So you can stand on their heads. Yeah, I remember this. Oh man, people, I remember from the Easter egg. Yeah. I, I remember liking the Mayhem Adventure much, but I played when I was a kid, so I didn't, probably had terrible taste. I liked Mega Man XX, for instance, but that game is absolutely terrible. I remember Pitfall 3D, which is the game you. you that had Bruce Campbell. I often like to kill Harry just to hear his weird grunts. I fucking knew it was a hole. I'm a fucking moron. Okay, one more time.
No, that was fucking stupid. Oh, you like Prefall 3? I thought it was fun for, for I played. Okay, so stream's over, guys. Thanks for stopping by. Maybe I'll stream something tomorrow. You know, it's, in 50 minutes, we're going to be seeing Argentina versus Brazil. Is Messi finally going to unfuck Argentina from the nearly 30-year-long 30 year, 30 year curse of not winning a fucking title with the selection? Or I was still going to be fucked anyways. Gracias por ver, chicos. Vamos a ver qué pasa ahora con Messi y la selección argentina. Si gana o no. <ríe> ¿Cómo sé? Bueno, gracias por ver el stream. Thanks for stopping by. I uh, will see you maybe tomorrow. See you around.